Hello, my name is Terry Seaman, and I'm a teacher here at Christ the King School, but I also wear another hat. I was a parent. Both of my daughters, Marie Rose and Laura, were students at Christ the King. They came to Christ the King originally because I lived across the street. We were Catholic, we belonged to the parish, and where else would they go to school but to the parish school? But I had the advantage of being able to look back and see what Christ the King gave to them because both my daughters now are successful adults. Both of them have excellent jobs and I credit that partially to the education that they received at Christ the King. Education is like building blocks. One thing builds on the other. And Christ the King was the first building block. It gave them the foundation. It gave them the basics that helped them to be successful when they went to high school and on to college. If you don't get those basics early on, children will struggle. They won't be able to meet their potential, but Christ the King made sure that they were able to reach their potential. And then of course, there's the other side. Education, the part that you learn, the reading and the math, it's very important. But the other side of it is how the children feel about themselves when they go to school. Do they feel comfortable? Do they feel welcomed? Do they feel like they're part of the family? I like to say that Christ the King is a big family in a small school, and that's what we are. The teachers cared about my daughters just like they were family. I think that Christ the King offers to all children this family environment, not just the children of the teachers, but all of the children. As a teacher, I look upon these children as my children. I call them my children because this is a family here and children can, can do so much better academically if they're in that kind of an environment. I don't think that there's any school that can do a better job than Christ the King School. I've been here for 32 years. I've seen many children and I think it's a privilege to be part of this community. Hi, I'm Kate Butler. I'm currently the grandmother of a student here at Christ the King. My four boys also went to Christ the King many years ago. They're men now. Um, I agreed to do this video because I love Christ the King and I believe in the mission of Christ the King. I love the teachers. Many of them have been here since my boys went to Christ the King. When you walk through the doors, you feel like you're home. You can feel the compassion, the caring, and the dedication from not just the teachers and administration, but also the families. The families are very involved and it's a real community. I feel that my granddaughter and my children as well got a great education here where they learn not only reading and math and subject material, but they also learn how to be good people. And I feel that that's a skill that they take with them through their lives. Um, I'm very comfortable with my granddaughter being here. She thrives here. Uh, everyone knows each other, so it's a very comfortable environment to learn. Um, it's a loving and warm environment. And like I said, you feel like you're home. And I feel that that's important. Uh, it's not just the learning aspect, but it's the family aspect and that uh, caring community feeling that Christ the King has. Hi, my name is Katherine McCarty. I'm the Advancement Director for Christ the King Grade School. Throughout my six months here, I have been so blessed to experience the collaboration and just sense of family that Christ the King brings every day. One of our slogans here is called Committed to Kindness, and I really see that throughout all grades, throughout the whole faculty and staff, and even the volunteers who donate their time and resources to Christ the King. I believe that one of our benefits of Christ the King is the small class size because it really helps our teachers have that one-on-one -on -one time to better serve their students. I'm really looking forward to how this annual school fund campaign turns out and all of the donations and support that alumni and friends of Christ the King can give to us. So again, thank you for your support and we look forward to future collaborations. Hi everybody, I'm Charles Chop. I'm the principal of Christ the King School. I've been here for 14 years, but it's my first year as principal. Um, and I just wanted to talk to you today about the Alumni Fund. I really, I'm glad that a lot of you are interested in, in donating. Um, I really appreciate those who have. 
and I can encourage all those people who uh, are thinking about it to, to, to help us out a little bit. We've been here for a long time, over 50 years, and the impact of this school and this community, I, I've only been here for 14 years, but I've noticed it since I've been here. And that's why I chose to stay here, and I chose to be the principal after it was offered to me. I believe in this school, I believe the people here, I believe in the students. I've seen a lot of people come and go, uh, but I see a lot of people return. And that's important to me. It's important to me to see the successes that have, uh, that have gone from here and have come back even bigger successes. Um, the kids that I taught 14 years ago are now starting to bring their kids back here. And that's, that's special to me because to see the, the successes they've become, it only gives me hope that those, that next generation is gonna be just as successful or even more so. Um, I, I've, I've always believed in this place. Uh, I was accepted here after my school that I taught at for 15 years closed. Uh, I was welcomed here like family, and I still feel that way. Everybody here has been here for a while. I'm actually one of the lower ones on the totem pole when it comes to seniority here. Um, that shows how important longevity is here. The, 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 the faith that people have in one another. It continue that, that growth, that, 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 that spread of the Christian message here in uh, Morrell Park. Uh, and so the people here can go out in the world and, and not just proclaim the gospel, but bring our joy to those people. It was very important to me that uh, this, the, what they've learned here, what they've gained here, uh, this family connection, this very uh, strong connection to this part of the city goes out to the rest of the city or even the rest of the world uh, and makes a difference somewhere. But thank you very much for what you've done and hopefully uh, you'll consider uh, giving in the future. Thank you.